What's up you guys? So I've had a lot of questions lately about how to use a base cell paste. And what a base cell paste is, is ultimately a paste that needs to be under the other colors in order to create your cells. That's how the dispersion works. So I'm going to show you guys how to properly use the base cell paste. The base cells that I have are from Color Passion. You can get them on our website, artisttilldeath.com. I have links down in the, the description box. And these are by Color Passion. All of their pastes are base cell pastes. So, for example, on this one, I'm putting the Color Passion base cell paste down first because it has to be under the other colors to work. Think like a basement. It's the lowest level in the house, right? So, let's move these out of the way. So we have our Color Passion, uh, Purple Passion base down first. And this color is Lorez Angel White. And for this example, I'm just gonna use a piece of paper to swipe the color. Now, because the purple has to be on the bottom, I'm making sure to lay my swiping paper in only the purple, nope, the white areas. And you can already see the cells starting to come up. I haven't done anything other than swipe the white over the purple. If I add some heat to it, it's gonna start to thin out the resin and make the cells grow even bigger as the resin starts to level out. See? Now I'm gonna show you what it looks like if I do that essentially backwards. So, I'm gonna put the white on part of the coaster. Sorry about it not being in focus. And then the color passion base cell on the other part. And I'm gonna swipe the purple over the white. This is how you shouldn't do it, but just for demo's sake, I'm going to do that just to show you guys. And because there's some over here, I'm just gonna swipe the white. <clears throat> Bless you. So there's a little bit of something happening, but it's not a lot. Certainly won't be as much as over here, actually. Let's just, for the sake of argument, commit to swiping some of the white over the purple on this side so you can see like an actual side-by-side -side comparison. Now already, sorry, because the reflection is just not focusing very well. Already you can see a definite difference between the white cells that are popping up and the purple. Let's put some heat on it. See, these look pretty good. These do not. If I do some finagling, and bring the white up above the purple, 
we may get something. Yeah, we're getting sales out here, but not over here because that's where the white is definitively on top versus down here. But that still looks pretty cool though. That should set up pretty nicely. So we'll see how that sets up. So as you can see by that side-by-side -side demo, you have to have the move this so you guys can see how they settle out you have to have the white or whatever color it is that you want to sell on top of the base cell or the color passion paste we get that question asked an awful lot also it's important to note that uh, base cell paste or the cell activators for resin typically don't like a lot of heat. When you add too much heat, it makes the resin move a lot more, disperse out a lot more, and the thinner your resin is, the more likely it is to move a little bit too much for what a base cell likes, and so your cells may not last if you use too much heat. That's why a lot of times I'll use the swipe method for pieces that I have the base cell paste. Let's do that same demo over here. I'm just gonna swipe it all the way over. Just so you can see it's not, it hasn't, not a whole lot to do with what colors you use, but rather what's in the color. Don't ask me what's in the base cells because I don't really know. All I know is that it works. So I haven't even put any heat on it yet, but you can see the difference in the cell structure. Not a whole lot happening here, but a whole lot of awesome happening here. Keep that in frame. So even if you prefer to do like dirty pours or whatever, and you wanna get those larger cells, you need to do um, what you can to keep your base cell under your other colors. It's also important to pay attention that whatever color you want your cells to be needs to be what's on top because that's what color your cells will be. So for example, the base cell that I'm using is a purple color. However, my cells won't be purple. They'll be whatever is on top of the purple. For example, I put white on top of the purple and so my cells are white in this one. On this one, I used Aquamarine by Color Obsession on top of the base cell purple. And so my cells are the Aquamarine color. That's really important because that, that gets mixed up often. So for example, if you wanted to do an ocean, you wouldn't want to get your base cell in white. You would want to get it in blue because that is going to be what color your cells turn out to be. You'd wanna put your regular white paste over a blue base cell to get white cells. I'm just gonna do a dirty pour because I haven't done one with these colors.
that should turn out interesting. Even now, the cells aren't purple. They're all of the colors that are on top of the purple. So yeah, I'm gonna do one more and then class is dismissed. I'm just gonna do kind of a messy all over type. Four. Just to show you, there's no real wrong way to apply your resin, except for that if you want your cells to come up, then your base cell has to be on the bottom. So for example, I'm swiping with my finger all the other colors uh, as much over the purple as possible. Granted, sometimes the purple is going to come up on top. That's fine. Um, but I just won't get as many cells there as I would if the white, nope, if the purple was on the bottom. Oops, sorry about that. So look how fun those cells are already. I didn't do anything but just run my hand across the surface of the piece good looking good looking piece already oh I forgot to add the gold I'm gonna try to swipe the gold over in some areas Got a little bit of heat and see what we got. Not too shabby. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this quick lesson on how to use the base cell pastes specifically the ones from Color Passion. It's the best ones that I've found on the market thus far, particularly, especially because Stone Coat discontinued theirs. But um, I carry Color Passion in these colors and all the other colors for the most part on our website, artisttilldeath.com. You can find them all there. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to us. I forgot to tell you guys, I'm Erica. We're artists till death. We do art usually every day, usually at 6 p.m. Join us. And uh, be kind to one another. You never know what someone's going through. And always remember. And always remember, we do the tests. So you don't have to. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Sorry, I